Hey y'all, thanks for checking out my video and or my solo. And now we are going to break it down. I stole these chords from a Leanne Rhymes tune, uh, Swingin'. And I, I think uh, that's Vince Gill playing on the original track. But here's a solo I worked out over it. And uh, I'll try to break it down and make it a little, make it make some, make it make some sense. Um, so starts with two bars on C. Uh, that's just a like a C dominant minor pentatonic lick. And from the C chord it goes to F before. And we're gonna start out using uh, major triads going up, but first major triad is E flat major triad. Slide into it, and then slide into F. Then we'll stay in F. Then do some chromatic in F down. More chromatic. And that's all stolen from just F dominant. So, and here we're going to bring in uh, some hybrid picking. So after we get there, we pick once with our pick on 3rd fret, slide into the 5th fret, then use your middle finger and ring finger to pick up this triplet. I use that quite a bit and, you know, more often than not, it's a little sloppy, <laughs> self-admittedly. Um, yeah, so you slide into that. And then after you use your fingers, you bring your pick back around to hit that fourth string. Then we do a similar thing right here. Go slide from fifth fret to seventh fret. Fingers again, middle, ring. And then use your pick to try to hit both these notes on the second and third string. Hit that again. That's just going down, chromatic down from the F root to the F flat seven. And that will put you over the C chord again. And then you'll hit the uh what is this? The 5 and the flat 3 of C. So that again I pick. Middle finger back up there. Yeah, that's over. Kind of C pentatonic dominant. With flat 3's in there. Alright, that's the first half of that solo, then we slide up to, or back to the F chord, and we'll go all the way up and do sort of an F dominant sound. So this is kind of taken from just root 3, 5, flat 7 of the F chord. But instead of just that, uh, we throw in a 9 or a 2, whatever way you want to think about it. And it's just sequences like four notes, but moving up the scale, go up four, go back three, go four, go back three, go four. You're on the nine right there, that's the nine of F. So nine, flat nine, root, flat seven. Then go back up to this similar riff. Which is the same thing that we did down here at C, but now it's an F. That's C, or sorry, F7 and uh, pentatonic and uh, dominant arpeggio type lick. So. from that F7 
Beethoven lick. Kind of get that twangy sound. I really just pluck the crap out of it with my thumb. Cool. So that's still an F. We're keep going after that lick. slide into G, the 5 chord. And here we'll be doing very similar look to the but down here in G. So and you end up at C. But we don't end on the root, we in on the root and then uh, slide to the flat seven. And then bend up to the C. All right. Well, I hope you dug that. And if there's uh, any way I can explain anything better, please leave a message in the comments or send me a direct message. And be sure to check out my website, MikeTuckGuitar.com, for other uh, lessons and video breakdowns of uh, solos just like this that I wrote. And um, check out my EP on Spotify called ChickenPickinEtudes.com, or Be a Bro and buy it on iTunes. Uh, thanks, and hope you dug.